friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Logi Learning. In this video, we are going to solve ICSE Mathematics Class Seven Chapter Eighteen Percentage and Its Applications Exercise Eighteen A Question Five. What have we got here? Find fifty-two centimeter as a percentage of one meters, right? So you see here that fifty-two centimeter as a percentage of what? One meters. So fifty-two centimeter of one meter can be written as what? Fifty-two upon what? One or one hundred? One. Why one hundred? Uh, sorry, not not one one uh, hundred, right? Okay, so first part, right? What have we got here? Fifty-two centimeter. Okay, centimeter of one meters, right? So always and always see that the units are same. Okay, fifty-two upon one hundred it will be. Why? Because one meter is in meters and fifty-two is in centimeters, right? So one is in centimeter and the other is in Meter, so that cannot be possible. We have to have one uh, same unit for both of our quantities, right? So this can be written as 52 upon, and we know one meter equals to how many centimeters? 100 centimeters, right? So 52 upon 100. Fine. Now percentage we have to find. Okay, 52 centimeter as a percentage of this one meter. So percentage for finding percentage or For converting fraction to percentage, what we do? Multiply by 100, right? So multiply 52 upon 100 by 100. Okay, cut this, cut this. So you get here 52 percent, right? This becomes our answer. Now let's move on to the next one. Right now, next one is the second part. Okay, what have we got here? Eight rupees eight as a percentage of 500. Okay, so rupees eight out of Rupees five hundred. This we can say right now. Here you see both of our quantities eight and five hundred are in what rupees. So we will keep it as it is. Don't convert anything. Now this can be written as what eight upon five hundred. Fine. This is rupees eight upon five hundred. Okay. And now you see here that um, okay. Now eight upon five hundred can be written as eight upon five hundred. Now for percentage. What we will do? Multiply by one hundred. Fine. Okay. So cut this zero and this zero. Right. So eight upon five percent, or you can convert this into mixed fraction. So one whole and three upon five. Right. One whole three upon five percent. This becomes our answer. And friends, this is all for today. If you are new to my YouTube channel, do not forget to subscribe. Hit that bell icon down below so that you get notified whenever I upload a new video. Leave a like on this one. Till then, take good care of yourselves and bye bye.